how's it going? This is uh, Marty Kokish, and uh, welcome to Marty's Garage. So I uh, got my buddy Matt over here today. Um, we worked on a stereo a little bit before previously, and uh, um, his uh, the rims on his car are kind of uh, cancerous looking. Oh, crap. Uh, crap looking. Ugh. They're all kind of dinged up, stained, nasty, and so. Uh, um, a couple, day, couple days ago, I just did the uh, the rims on uh, my Volvo, and I bought two cans of this uh, uh, rim paint stuff, and uh, I only used one of them, so I've got a spare one, so we're going to do his car now, so. He's going to give me a rim job. Uh, yeah. All right, be back in a bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I jacked up one side of the car, uh, pulled the tires off, so we got we them sitting out here, so. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to uh, wet dry sand them, or wet sand them. We want to get all the all the crap and gunk off of here and uh, just to make a nice surface for the uh, paint to adhere to. And uh, yeah, so I've got uh, got some of this stuff over here using uh, 320 grit wet dry sandpaper. So i got my hose over here, so we'll hose these down and, and sand them up. And... Uh, then we should be ready to start masking them off to uh, paint. Some fire tonight. All right. Um, <coughs> so, well, we sanded them all down and uh, threw on a coat of paint. So, we've got two of them kind of done. And then uh, covering up the lug nuts on each of his wheels, he's got these uh, uh, little mini hubcap things. So, the the centerpiece looked pretty good. So we just uh, we. It's like nice and shiny and stuff, so we uh, taped those off with some paper and masking tape and uh, threw a coat on here um, so they'll match. And uh, you know, one thing you can do is uh, you can mask up the whole tire with uh, uh, newspapers or take a big piece of paper, cut a hole in it, and tape it on there. And and uh, but it takes a long time to do. So uh, I don't know. My trick is to kind of just I have a piece of uh, tag board like this, and I just kind of uh, hold it on the rim of the wheel as I go around and uh, paint it. And you get some overspray, and the solution to that, which Matt is taking care of right now, is uh, I just uh, use an, uh, take a rag and uh, uh, pour some gas on it, and uh, you can scrub off all the, uh, the overspray and stuff with that. It ends up being much quicker, and uh, I, I guess I don't need to explain the, the safety features when it comes to uh, gas, because um, if you uh, burn yourself up and die, you're uh, really helping out the whole uh, Darwin thing. So, <laughs> um, but so here's one that's done, and uh, um, the tires on his passenger side we haven't done yet, so I'll show you kind of what the before looks like. So. Here's kind of what we were dealing with before. I don't know. You can see they're kind of they're pretty scuzzy. So I don't know. And uh, every single one of his tires is like this. So um, you know the clear coat's peeling off, and uh, uh, it's just really scuzzy looking. And I guess I, I wouldn't uh, I wouldn't blame it on Matt because um, it's not like it's just one tire. It's every single one of them looks like garbage. I guess so, but I don't know. We're doing pretty good, um, but uh, uh, I think we'll probably call it quits for tonight. I think. Yeah. So, uh, you yeah. know, as always, uh, thanks for watching. Um, shows available on iTunes and Zoom Marketplace, and uh, you can watch the show streaming online at www.martune.net. Thanks. Okay.